for my flight to the Cook Islands tonight. A bit of a haul, some pimple patches. We're getting there. so you don't see my really messy room. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Today is gonna be one hell of a video. I have pretty much eight hours to get ready for my flight to the Cook Islands tonight. Welcome to the vlog. Hopefully this video isn't too chaotic because I will most likely be rushing around and we'll probably have another mental breakdown, but it's okay. Last night I wrote a to-do list on my iPad because I just knew if I didn't have a to-do list prepared already, it just wouldn't have been very good. This is my to-do list. It's very long. Yeah, okay. I'm going to the Cook Islands for 10 days with my boyfriend and his family. And it's going to be a wholesome little trip away. I've never been to the Cook Islands, but I've heard it's absolutely stunning. So I'm very grateful that I have the chance to go. But yeah, I have got quite a bit of uni to bring with me and to get done whilst I'm there. So I just wanna make sure I have like everything planned and organized whilst I'm still in Sydney so that I can just like execute my schedule and my to-do list whilst I'm there and I don't have to like really think hard about if I'm forgetting something or if I still have to do something and X, Y, Z. So that's today's job. We have gone to the gym so I can tick that one off. I have a laser appointment at 9.40. It's currently 8.30. So I've got a little bit of time before I have to leave. And then whilst I'm at the shops, I need to get my nails done. You don't want to see the state of these phalanges. And I might treat myself to a bit of a manicure and a pedicure because I haven't had that in a while. I need to go to Chemist Warehouse and buy a shit ton of products that I've just like run out of and that I need. I have to pack for my trip. Obviously, that's kind of self-explanatory. I have to pick something up from the post office and just do a bunch of like chores at home before getting ready for my flight tonight. I think what I'm going to do is start packing and like laying out a bunch of clothes and things to bring with me just so that I can like start feeling productive because I'm a little bit overwhelmed at the moment. We are going for 10 days, which is a substantial amount of time in my head. So I do need to actually think about what I'm gonna wear. Start packing, start getting shit done. We're fine, we're fine. As long as I start getting ready for the airport at 5 p.m. We'll be sweet. Okay. Suitcase has been acquired. I've got like a bunch of these packing cubes which might come in handy. Maybe I should start charging my devices. That's a plan. Headphones. I'm also gonna put my iPad on charge. I don't know what this is, but I feel like I'm gonna need it. Done. Just ignore the absolute atrocious state of my wardrobe. I feel like, I feel like I need 10 nice outfits and then 10 daytime outfits. And then just like a bunch of shoes. So I started with the easiest thing to pack the nighttime outfits because I've just picked eight different dresses and more dressier outfits. This is the current state of my bed. Yep, okay. <laughs> battery died but I had to take a break from packing because I have to go to my laser appointment but we're making some pretty good progress don't know how all this is gonna fit inside my suitcase and 
and not go over 20 kilos, but that is a problem for future Alexia. I'm also going to go get my nails done and pick up some things from the shops. We're getting it done slowly. It's currently 9.17. Let's go do my laser. <laughs> $136 at Mecca on makeup that I didn't really need. Maybe. It is currently 11.43. I need to jet home and really start getting shit done. I have a couple of things that I will haul. I'll show you what I got from the shops when I get home. I got a couple of really exciting goodies. I shall show you that when I get home. But as of now, I need to go to the post office quickly, pick something up, and then jet home at home. Look who has decided to show up on my bed amongst my array of clothes. Also, do we like my nails? I got bubble bath. Actually, this is a bit different than I would usually. I got two coats, funny bunny, one coat, bubble bath by OPI. Something different. I saw it on Pinterest. And then I just got white toes, of course. <sighs> okay. I wanted to give you guys a bit of a haul of what I got from the shops. I might have done some damage at Mecca. I literally went in to get one thing, which was a travel size of the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. I've got like the full size, but does anyone else's mascara start spilling out of the sides? So like now half the mascara is covered in black product and it just gets on all of my other products. So I got a small size. And then, I mean, I went in and I had recently finished my favorite concealer, the Too Faced Born This Way concealer. And I was gonna just get a repurchase of that concealer, but then I remembered that I've seen this recommended on TikTok, the Kosas Creamy Concealer. And the lady was there and she was like, do you want me to color match you? And I was like, you know what? Yes, yes please. So she ended up color matching me. And I don't know if you can really see it, but I have some underneath my eyes and it is just, Phenomenal. She definitely has good customer service marketing skills because I bought it. I then bought myself, this was definitely an impulse buy and I definitely didn't need it, but I got the Leno Lips Glazed Donut Multi Balm Ointment. Oh, that actually smells really good. That literally smells like a Krispy Kreme donut as well. And then finally, I got a little set from. Uh, this brand, I can never pronounce it, but it comes with a little fragrance mist, lotion, and shower cream. And I just thought I could just bring them with me on my trip. And I've always wanted to try the Brazilian bum bum cream. So I got that. And then I went to Chemist Warehouse. I just needed a couple of refills of some of the products that I had run out of. I got another bottle of the La Rose Pose pimple cream that I use. Um, it's the Duo Corrector. I've been through so many of these. It's my favorite. I had to get a little travel size, I was about to say shampoo and conditioner, toothpaste and toothbrush, a little deodorant because I had run out and your girl doesn't want to be smelling. Some pimple patches. These are 
a lifesaver. I needed a new beauty blender, so I got just a sponge and then a beauty blender sponge case. I think yes. I got a little protein bar. This one's my favorite. Well, actually, it's not really a protein bar. It's an energy bar from Cliff. Light chocolate macadamia is my favorite. Just a snack on the plane. A couple of these uh, superfood balls. They're just, they're good snacks for the plane. I got berry cashew and cacao and peanut butter and caramel. But yes, that's my really quick haul. I'm gonna get back into packing because I've got like four hours left. We're actually on track. I did miss my laser appointment by 10 minutes. And if you know laser appointments, you have to get there on time. Otherwise, you know, they're usually back to back. So it was entirely my fault, but I managed to reschedule it. So that's a plus. Okay, I'm just procrastinating at this point. So let's start packing again. <laughs> Progress has been made. I've pretty much packed everything clothes related. Not sure how I'm going to get this massive pile of clothes into my suitcase, but that's a problem for me in 30 minutes. I need to pack some underwear, socks, gym clothes, shoes, accessory. Oh my God, I've still got so much to do. I think I'm going to take my two Beckham Bridge hats because they're just staple, a black one and a cream one. This rider wear one to wear like when I work out. Those are going in my bag. I need gym gear because I wanna go for a couple of runs whilst I'm there. I think I'm just gonna bring my two Crop Shop Boutique sports bras and my two Gymshark sports bras. I'm gonna take a pair of leggings. Need a pair of sweatpants, do we? I don't think we do. Nah, I don't think we do. I don't mind how feral my shoes look, but these are the shoes that I'm going to bring. Runners for like walks and runs and whatnot. Burks, which I'll probably wear to the airport. I know. I know, but I won't wear socks with them, I promise. Black sandals. I may not bring these ones. They're a staple. And then a lighter version of a sandal. So I think that's what I'm going to bring. I don't know how I'm going to fit my shoes inside that suitcase. Are three pairs of sunnies too excessive? Maybe, but I really want to bring these because I just got them. They're from AM Eyewear and they're so cool. And these ones are just my favorite from Key, but I'm just like, maybe three is a bit excessive. I'll sit on it. So for handbags, I think I'm going to bring my white one from Bellini. It's new. It comes with like a crossbody as well, but I'm not going to bring the crossbody. And just my metallic black one from... I think this is from Pete and Jane, I think. I'm gonna bring those, and then I'm also gonna bring my little handmade beach bag that I got from Bali, from like a little Balinese lady at one of the markets. We're getting there. So I've packed all of my makeup and liquids. I've got literally everything I can think of in this bag, all my makeup, hopefully I've got everything. I feel like I just keep like finding things that I need to bring with me. Oh, you know what I almost forgot? I almost forgot to bring bikinis and we're going to a tropical island. This is my bikini box. Have to bring this one from Katumi Swim. I'm gonna bring this Set. I might actually bring both of my Katumi swim sets. The green one is just stunning. I am gonna bring just a standard black set from Glassens. You always need a black one piece. I'm gonna bring this set from Kulani Kinis. It's like a strapless blue. I'm gonna also bring my green strapless set from Kalani as well. And that's kind of the vibe we're going for. Do we bring brown? We don't need. I'm actually pretty proud of myself. I culled like a lot. The 
fatigue is well and truly hitting me. I wanted to do a bit of a to-do list check to see how I'm going with my to-do list. 3 p.m. and I have to leave in three hours, technically two hours and 45 minutes. So laser was not completed. I got my nails done. I've got my nails done. I bought all the products that I needed from the chemist. I am still packing for my trip. And then I pretty much just need to organize uni and finish packing and then my to-do list is pretty much done. <laughs> made a little bit of a snack because I need some fuel I <laughs> she's having fun I have hit a wall oh my god I feel like it needs something more I found a tomato That's better. Okay, so I just got ready. I don't know if this is acceptable to wear to the airport or not, but it's just a matching set from Nude Lucy. I've pretty much finished packing. Just need to close up my suitcase. I've showered, gotten ready, popped on an outfit. <laughs> My bag is all packed and we're pretty much ready to go to the airport. I am not sure how I managed to pull that off in one day. I work well under pressure. I feel like I need to have a nap of some sort because I am knackered. I'm not sure what I'm going to film at the airport or if I'm going to film. I might take a couple of clips and include them at the end of this video, but I think I might end it here. I hope you've enjoyed watching this vlog. It was a bit chaotic. I don't know, it was a bit of fun filming and it kept me accountable to actually get everything done. I will see you in my next video. Ciao. Wee.